Snakes! Vile snakes! Their tawdry affair has been unearthed. In all my years, I have never set eyes upon a man so consumed with grief as our king is now. His heart has been torn asunder by that Jezebel! Guinevere! And as once loyal knight, that godforsaken creature, Sir Lancelot. He has disgraced all that it means to be a knight. Arthur has dissolved the royal table, and the queen has been sentenced to burn at the stake. And I'll say it's no less than that wench deserves. The round table gone. A champion disgraced, and a king about to execute his queen. To think I should live to see a day like this. I am sure that no man has looked as empty as Arthur did when Guinevere was tied to the stake. But just as the kindling had caught, Lancelot's mighty war horse charged through the crowd and plucked the lady from the rising flames. The knights surrounded them, but Lancelot's visage was like a demon's as he whirled his sword about him, brutally slaying Sir Gawain's brothers Gaheris and Gareth. I would never have believed Lancelot could do such a thing. Perhaps Morgan's curse has come to pass after all. Arthur has sworn revenge on his former champion and is planning to siege Lancelot's home of Joyous Guard in France. <laughs>